don't forget. Good morning, you lovely people. Thank you very much for tuning in. Hopefully this, uh, this will be a uh, good vlog. Uh, I'm back down uh, Island Lake, back in Tilly Swim, one of my, uh, my old favourites. Uh, I've come down here this week because uh, I've got a little wet bag with me, Aussie, making a bit of a noise this morning, these, but never mind. Uh, as you can see, I've already set up. I've chucked the rods out quick whilst I was before I set up, so I'm going to pull them in a little while. I haven't put any proper bait out yet. So I've got three rods, three spots, three different rigs this week. So I'm just trying something, something different, see what happens. There's a couple of people on the lake. Uh, I got here uh, very early. Well, not very early, but I got here um, just as it was getting light. So. Sorry, he's whinging. I uh, got it about 20 past six, uh, just as it's getting lighter, so I could set up. But yeah, I'm gonna now set up, I'm gonna put the kettle on, I'm gonna have a cup of tea, uh, relax, and then I'm gonna pull the rods in, show you all three wigs, and uh, we'll go from there. Season baits. These pellets are looking lovely. Oh, you can't really see them. Eight mils. Look in the old. There we go. Set this up. Yeah. So put some of these in. These are spice boily. These these are just crumble. So soft and nice. So I'm going to do some of that. And the old ones as well. Also, the old corn. Ten of that. Lovely. I don't want to be making too much out, I'm not going to be chucking too much out. But I've got the old slick insect. Like stuff in a bit of a shake. Don't go too mad. Give it a good old stir. Leave that soak for a little bit. I'll put that out in the margin a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to be spotting out. Uh, I don't know. I've got my spot rod, but I don't know if I'll be spotting out at all. Let's get that up. 
Ooh. Yeah. So I think I might just. I've got one in the left hand margin, I've got one out the middle, and I've got one to the left a little bit further out. I might just bring it in, bring it in a little bit. Just have two in the margins and one down the middle. It's served me well before, so that's what I might do now. Uh, but I can't remember the last time I had a bite during the day on this lake. It's, it's been ages. Don't get day bites on it. Don't know why. As soon as it gets dark, I might have a couple tonight. I'm hoping. But I'll be amazed if I ever fish during the day. But yeah, uh, we've got to try. So I'm going to pull these rods in, show you the rigs I'm using, and then show you a little bit of bait out. Right, the first rig I'm using is a D rig. Now, I'm much too clumsy to tie one of these myself, so we've got these D kickers out of DSD. Just slide it on there, mark the swivel, bit of a bait floss, and you can chuck any old, any, any hook bait on there. So, that's what I'm using first. Yep, yeah, I've never used it, so I'll see what it's like on this session. It could go well, could go horribly wrong, don't know. Nice flat pair lid from Voodoo Lids, the rest is all TSD. Excellent stuff. Tungsten um, anti tangle lead clip. And this is going to go out on the left hand side of the swim. Well, that was shocking. <laughs> Three attempts to flick it out to the edge. Terrible. Oh well, it's there now. Right, so, second mig. It's a, a Wani. Pre-made Wani from DSD, as usual. Again, two clumps that make me sound. It's easier just to get them in. Brilliantly made. Bit of old tungsten uh, putty, just to weigh it down. 12mm uh, uh, 2 you pop that and the same lead clip system as the other rod. I'm just going to flick this to the right hand side of the swim so I can scoop out some baits and put over the top. And finally, tried and trusted solid bag. So, bit of a slow sinking corn on there. A few inch rig. It's on the um, tubing set up, so I'll have to dry that off, make bags as we go along. Just getting used to that, because everything at the other lakes are all tubing, so I don't want it naked line on there. So I'm going to make up a bag and then I'm going to chuck that one out.
Like I said, they're the three wicks. One to the left, one to the right. Solid bag in the middle, get a bait over the left and right. All the wigs, all the components, everything there um, is all DSD, as always. Um, and if you like what you see, just jump on the uh, DSD website, I'll leave a link in the description. Sorry. Um, yeah, jump on there and use my discount code, Leeds10. It's quality gear. If you're worried about the gear, I'll tell you what, uh, jump onto the DSD YouTube channel. Um, they've just put a, a video up at Sandhurst, a uh, social that I unfortunately like to miss. But the weed at Sandhurst was absolutely horrendous, and the fish they were getting in, they were bringing in some bangers through the weed. Uh, they were getting weeded up all the time, but they're still bringing the fish in. It just shows the quality of the gear we got. So, yeah, have a look. Have a look at the website, have a look at the YouTube channel. So, yeah, just use my discount code. And get 10% off your orders. Yeah, so that's it. All the rods are done. I'm gonna step down. Dogs are sleeping in the bivvy, so I'm gonna stay out here just to give them a bit of rest. But yeah, I'll keep you updated. I'm not far from the swim, so I can hear my rods. As soon as it's there, I'll just stay around the back. Yeah. Give them a bit of exercise as they've been asleep most of the morning. By the way, nothing's happening on the fishing front. We're all excited because I had a single beep on a middle rod. That's it. That's all I'm expecting, to be honest. Uh, yeah, daytime on here. I don't catch, so. Well, never mind. That's the, uh, what's the time now? It's, uh, ooh, one o'clock. Uh, we've had a bit of lunch, we've never had a bit of exercise. <sighs> Lots are doing nothing. Uh, well, yeah, keep you updated on what's going on. <sighs> well, quick update. It's getting to about half five, quarter six now. It's not getting dark soon. Uh, I'd love to tell you it's been an exciting day, but after our little run around, me and the dog had a nap. I've had absolutely nothing, no signals, no nothing. I haven't even seen any fish in this area. The only fish I've seen is right over the back in the, in the corner. <sighs> yeah, so, I'm hoping, now it's going to start getting dark, I might start getting some bites. But I've had absolutely nothing. So, I've had my dinner. I'm going to have a run around with a dog. I'm going to redo the rods just before it gets dark. Chuck another little bit of bait out. I've already made it up. Same, exactly the same as this morning. A couple of scoops over each side. Solid bag down the middle. See what that brings. It's like... It, I cannot get a bite during the day. I cannot. I don't know why. I haven't seen him in the north either. I haven't heard him over there opposite in, a, in the Astro and someone's turned up in Slope and I haven't heard, heard any bites on there either but then I've had a nap so I could have missed it <laughs> but anyway this will probably be my last update uh, until the morning unless I get a bite and then I will show you that and I think one of these baby geese is just about to wipe out my rod anyway Oh great, well I'm going to do my rods now.
<coughs> time is now 4.25. I finally got one in the net. That's really sweet time. It's only a little common. He's in there. Let's get it out. Had a quick look. Oh dear. Yeah, four thirty. Tiny little common, seven pound three. This was the left hand rod. Oh, on, on the uh, on the D rig. Let's have a quick look. Okay. There we go. Yeah. <clears throat> we should be getting rid of some of these in the next year. The little ones. Just turn that right down a little bit. See if there's any better. Anyway, yeah, finally, only got a few hours till we get home, so chuck this back, hope for another one in the night. on it on the gold. I'll do that. I'll get it back. Well, morning. That was a pretty disappointing session, I believe. I was expecting a bit more than that. Nah, no, it's just over 12, it's 24, 25 hours. Yeah, smallest common in the lake, I think, seven pounds on it. Oh well, never mind. It's another session down here. Well, I've got a, a there's a comp match, competition match down here. I think it's about three weeks time. I've put the name in, but sessions like this down here. I don't know. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see. But yeah, uh, yep, we're nearly packed up as you see. Aussie's had his breakfast. I've had a bit of munch. Time to pack up and go home. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe and all that jazz and do that. Uh, it's been most appreciated having you lovely people watch my film, vlogs. So yeah, the next one. Don't know when the next one will be. Hopefully it'll be a, um, either Sutton or Alton Kirby or maybe Dartford Lakes. I don't know. One of them. Or I might just wait until the, the match and do a little bit there. Don't know. But thank you very much and I'll see you next time.